includes dozens of neighbors in one Rancho Palos Verdes neighborhood being told to be ready to evacuate ahead of power shutoffs tomorrow. Those homeowners were given less than 24 hours to get out. SoCal Edison plans to turn off their power to about 140 homes in the Portuguese Bend area. The power shutoffs will begin at noon tomorrow. Gas service to these same homes has already been shut off. It's been off for a month. As the land has shifted, power lines recently came down, causing a fire, which has pushed the need to turn the power off entirely to the highest level. And a community meeting was held tonight. Eyewitness News reporter Amy Powell live in the impacted community tonight. Amy, what are you hearing from neighbors? Well, Michelle, I can tell you there's a lot of stress and a lot of frustration among the residents here. As you said, just a month ago, their gas service was shut down. Now tomorrow, SoCal Edison says it will cut off the electricity. And on top of all that, the city of Rancho Palos Verdes has issued that evacuation warning, urging residents of about 100 homes to be prepared to evacuate if there is a threat to public safety. Now, Southern California Edison says it plans to cut off electricity at noon Sunday, affecting about 100 140 customers in the Portuguese Bend community. Uh, residents are very upset, some saying they didn't receive notice about the power shutdown until earlier today. Many rushing to buy generators, preparing to continue living in their homes. Uh, the loss of utility service stems from the ongoing land movement in the community that has caused significant damage to houses and left roads cracked and buckled. Now, the city warning residents that once the power is turned off, they should not use water or plumbing because that that could cause a sewer spill. Now, according to SoCal Edison, residents were notified on July 30th that it was possible they would lose electricity service because of the increasing problems caused by land movement. The company says a recent fire raised more concerns about safety. What's happened is that the situation has become more dangerous. And so out of caution, we need to turn the power off. Um, there was a fire last week. It was a small fire. But the fire was caused when one of our lines fell because of land movement. And that shows how dangerous this area is. Yes, I'm frustrated. I think that if, if their infrastructure, if Edison's infrastructure truly was posing an imminent safety risk, then that would necessitate an immediate shutdown. But they're giving us 24 hours. If their commitment truly is to this neighborhood, um, then I think they could have very easily given us more warning. Now, the city says an emergency assistance center will be open to help impacted residents tomorrow. Again, the power is set to be shut off at noon tomorrow. Reporting live in Rancho Palos Verdes, Amy Powell, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.